my blessings to you. Can you sing, uh, prepare for tomorrow? Sita Kamala, Kucha Mandana, Dhrita Kundalai, Dhrita Lalit, Banma, Jai Jai, Indian tube of Puri. Puriya, uh, Puriya melody. You remember? Of the Now, <coughs> his father was fearing from Pallad Maharaj, but he could not do anything. The lords of demigods, even so powerful, have you, you have heard, he will not dive any anyone created by Brahma in daytime. Night time, out of house, in house, in month, in year, we can, we, but he began. What? Huh? Very afraid. Very afraid. Helpless, totally helpless. What to do? He become Kim Kathak What should I do? And he was puzzled. Then Sandamar told. Why you are fearing? You are so all demigods. They have, they are fearing from you. Or oh, return back this boy again for some days. My guru, my guru and father, Sukra Shad will go come, and he will teach all the things. Don't worry. And they took Pranav Maharaj in teach school, and again they were explaining duplicacy, politics, politics and hypocrisy and other things. One day they told to the boys, a student, for a couple of hours I am going outside, we both. Pralad Maharaj, Pralad, like a monitor of the school, he will look after all boys, you should not quarrel. Be peaceful under his guidance. Just couple of minutes I will return back. Then he proceeded. After that, they began to oh, play here, there, going. Very happy that Guru is not here. No controller. But Prahlad Maharaj very humbly requested them to come and to hear what he wants today. He wants to speak to them. Anyhow, they were controlled because they used to have so much honor for Parla, though he was five or six years age. They assembled there and Parla Maharaj began to tell. Oh my Brothers, friends, you should listen. From the very beginning of our life, we should meditate Supreme Lord. You know that anything in this world cannot be itself. Some tells that nature has them. By nature everything. But nature, what is the meaning of nature? Nature, that is the power of Krishna. Only the power of Krishna can control and create millions of universe and in minor and in a moment again millions of universes can be new created. So he is very powerful. He knows you all, but you don't know. But I know something. So from the beginning of your life, don't waste your time. Old age is bound to come. Race is bound to come. 
and what you collect in this life, wealth, reputation, position, or anything, you have to give up it here. And you cannot take a farthing or anything from this world. Do you agree? Oh yes. Why not? You are telling the truth. We will also be old and we will have death to die. So from beginning of life, don't waste your time. In politics, hypocrisy, hypocrisy and others. Remember, Supreme Lord is Krishna. He is very powerful. He is very merciful, causeless merciful. And he has invested his all power, all beauty, all attraction, sweetness, and causeless mercy in his name. Krishna is so powerful. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu made it more powerful. Invested love and affection and everything it is means. So you should chant, remember these names. Among them, those who was as a leader, he told Pralar, why we should oh, chant and take the name of Krishna? Why not we? Now, in young age, we should play, we should be expert in making money and other things that we, by that we can be happy. Lord Maharaj, don't. don't do so. Don't do so. Who knows that when you will be old or not, within coming old as you will die tomorrow or day after tomorrow or just now. Thunderbolt will come and in a minute you are finished. You are going by aeroplane anywhere in a moment, machine fell. You all with 700 persons are killed. Where your body and bones went, you will not know. <laughs> and if, in case you are saved by this and you become old, then after 80 you cannot sit straight. You cannot churn. So many group of diseases will come. Your son and, oh, Wife of son will make so many problems. <laughs> Daughter in law. <laughs> they will broom your what? Back. Oh, they will clean. <laughs> Don't worry for that. So you cannot chant and remember. So from Bible. Kaumash. Kaumar Acharit Pragyo Dharman Bhagavata Nehiya So, from beginning of your life or whenever you have this knowledge from a good association whether you are of fifty, no harm. But anyhow, by luck, by your previous Sukriti, you associated with them. And this knowledge came, then from then. We should try to oh, develop Krishna brain, Krishna consciousness. We should not look lose our time, waste our time in sense gratification and others. Oh. Why? Wherever you go, this is the right result for you. Animal life. If you are hog and pigs, oh, unlimited wives you can collect. No use of expending money. 
No dying horse. Oh, new, new, so many, so many. No court case, nothing. Uh, no maintenance of soul and children. Oh, you have only one son or daughter in one year, not more than that. And if twin, twin, twin comes then two, not than that, not three, four. But hogs and pigs and dogs at a time, eight, ten, twelve, sixteen even. So, they are more superior than that. At any time, if any, any species of life, you can have all the animals sense gratification. Animals are more, animals are more eh? expert in uh, sense gratification than you. So don't worry for that. From beginning of your life, you should chant and remember and meditate, Krishna. One thing more, as suffering comes without invitation, no need of invitation. All kinds of problems, death, old age, diseases, or quarreling from neighbors and so many things. For government now, so many problems are created. So, they come without invitation, without any warning. So if, by previous fruitive karma you have oh so much happiness, then it will come automatically. No need of doing anything. Belief in God. And whatever fruit you come, you have done. The reaction will come. And automatically all kinds of happiness will come without invitation. Why you are so anxious for this? In this life, don't want any happiness. Don't want to Remove your difficulties only. This is not the aim and object of our life. They should come, they will come. And they will come forcibly. And you will have to test. So in this, you are not free. You will have to bound to test all these things. So why you are wasting your time? Now you should begin the holy name, chanting the holy name of Krishna, very powerful. Krishna has made it more merciful, more beautiful. All the sweet pastimes of Krishna are in name. Don't think that name is merely name. Very powerful. All the sweet pastimes of Krishna are in this name. So, from beginning you should. Suppose, in Kali Yuga, your age is 100. In Satya Yuga, the age used to be more than 1 million years. 1 lakh. Or some more than this. Some immortal like. They are not dead. And in Treta, lesson something. Ten thousand about. And in Dwapar, Dwapar? Uh, Dwapar. One thousand nearly. And in Kaliju, uncontrolled life. Taking whiskey, cigarette, smoking, eggs and meats and wines. It lessens over ages. 
and TB, cancer, so many kinds of new rogues that cannot be controlled in the hospitals and by scientists or anybody. New, new AIDS. We don't know so many rogues are not new coming by all uncontrolled. So, if you have 100 years age, in hundred, half of the time, goes in night or day sleeping. And if you are not controlled, then less than that. The boyhood up to, up till 24, 25, let us suppose 20. It goes in vain in being expert, playing, studying and everything. And the age from 80 to 100, useless. You cannot do. You cannot see. And then 10 years more. You will have to marry. If not, not only one time. Oh, do divorce and again, again divorce and again. Nothing, no gain. So, children will come. You will have to give for a study, manage for a study, for other things. In the meantime, you must have a core. You must have all the necessary equipment of your houses and television oh, and so many things, new, new things. Oh, especially computer. So, so many things. When you will do bhajan? No time at all. So what you should do? They ask from Prahlad Maharaj and you should tell. Can you? Tomorrow? Ajam mil. Ajam mil. Oh. Ambarish Mahat. Om Agyana Timirandha Svagyananjana Salakaya Chakchurun Militam Jena Tasmai Sri Guravi Namaha. Ambarish Mahat. So, when Sri Parlad Maharaj told all these things to his friends. Then his friends told, O oh, Prahlad, our teacher, Sanda and Amarka, never taught all these things. From where do you have learned all these things? Only our teacher taught us diplomacy, hypocrisy, politics, etc. So from where are you learning all these things? Prahlad Mahai told, I have learned all these things from my Guru Sri Narodrisi when I was in the womb of my mother. How much time? Then they told, how come? You know all this from your mother's womb? They narrate the whole story. He, have, he was in his mother's womb about 60,000 years. When his father, Hiranyakashipu, went for severe austerity, at that time, Prahlad Maharaj was his mother's womb. Then demigods, headed by King Indra, they want to kill the Hiranyakashipu's ancestor who was resting in his mother's womb. What? Oh, sorry. Descender in his mother's womb. Sorry. So, then they caught him and want to take him to heavenly planet, when she will give birth, then they will kill him. In the meantime, Naradusi came down from Vaikuntha planet, holding Binani's hand and chanting, Sriman Narayana 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 Sriman Narayana 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 oh. When he came down and told, O oh, King Indra, what nonsense thing you are doing? Then Indra told, O oh, Naradrisi, Pralam, the Kayadhu, carrying of the power of Hiranyakashipu, 
When the boy will come, he will terrorize the whole world like his father. Narada Sri told, O oh Indra, he should not be a demon like his father. He is a great devotee of Bhagavan. Even you tried at your level best, you could not kill him. So don't do any effort. You are not able to kill him. <coughs> then Indra, do pranam and dir parikram of Kayadhu for Prahlad Maharaj and went away from there. Then Naradisi took her to his ashram and he taught all this Vaishnav philosophy for Prahlad Maharaj. Prahlad Maharaj was his mother's room and Prahlad Maharaj told all these things to his demonic friend. Oh Prahlad, then how he can do bhajan? Then Prahlad told, Guru Sushru Saya Bhakta Sarvala Bharpa Nena Cha Sangyana Sadhu Bhakta Nam Isharala Dhanena Cha Oh, listen carefully. Guru Sushru Saya Bhakta You have to serve your Guru Dev with full intimacy. Guru Sushru Saya Bhakta with full devotion. And Sarvala Bharpa Nena Cha Which you have gained, have to offer to Guru Dev. Which you have. When he came in this world, Muthi Bandh ka aya jagat mein hap pasar se jayega. When anyone taking birth, then his and his fist is like close. And when someone will die, you can see his hand is open. So nothing we brought from there, nothing we can take with us. So, which we have? So our Purvachaj has told, Manasa deha geha jo kichu mor, Oripillu tu apade namda kishor. Which we have, which he told, this is I and this is mine, have to offer everything to the lotus feet of Guru Pahad Padma. Guru Sushru Sya Sarvalabhar Pani Nacha. Morobhar Sangena Sadhu Bhakta Nam. You have to be always in good association. You think, oh, I am Vaishnav, why I shall attend his class? I should not go there. And Guru Dev is here, then we are combined. When we go one to another country, then we call each other. This is not Vaishnava philosophy. Always be in good association. And then, Isar Aradha Nenacha. Then you will be Isar Aradhana. So it is called Krishna no Silan. Other degrees will raise this question. We, are, we will do Krishna no Silan. Why we shall serve to Guru Dev? Because our Purvacharya told, Tadiya. Guru Dev, Vaishnav, Ganga, Jamuna, Tulasi, Giriraj Maharaj, all are Tadiyajan. As well, we are serving Krishna. Doing Krishna Nusilan, we have to serve his Tadiyajan also. Then Krishna will be happy. Then we prepare Krishna Nusilan. Krishna means all incarnation of Krishna, all Vishnu Tattva. Moreover, Krishna means Asrai Krishna, Bonafide Guru Pahad Padma. Moreover, Krishna means Krishna plus Anusilan means who give us knowledge to do bhajan of Krishna? Who is that? Sri Krishna Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. To do bhajan of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu also Krishna Anusilan. Moreover, Krishna plus Anusilan. If you do Krishna bhajan, then it's Krishna Anusilan. Moreover, the ultimate goal of Gaudiya Vaishnavas, Krishna plus Anusilan. Who is Krishna? Srimati Radha Thakurani. Under guidance of Rupa Manjari, who is serving Krishna, Divine couple, leaning towards Krishna, leaning towards Krishna, Srimati Radhika, that is Krishna Anusilan. So Prahlad Maharaj is telling, Guru Sushru Seya Bhakta Sarvala Bharpani Nacha, Sangena Sadhu Bhakta Nam, Isharara Dhani Nacha. You have to do bhajan like this way. So all Prahlad Maharaj's friends, they became very happy and they follow Prahlad Maharaj completely and they start chanting according to, taught by Prahlad Maharaj. When they are chanting Bhagavan name, after some time, Sonda and Amarka arrived there. Oh, what are you doing? Prahlad, you polluted all your friends. Then Sonda and Amarka went to Hiranyakasipu and informed him, Oh, Hiranyaka, oh demon, oh, king of demon, your son polluted the whole class, whole school. Then Hiranyakasipu came from there and became very angry. Oh, Prahlad. What are you doing nonsense thing? From where are you getting all this power? Prahlad told, Oh my dear father, from where are you getting power? 
I am getting from same source. All world getting power from same source, only one source. Is Vishnu. Is Almighty, Omnipotent, Omniscient. When Prahlad told all this, Hinakasu became more angry and trembling with by anger. Oh, where is your Vishnu? Prahlad Mahi replied humbly, is everywhere. Everywhere? Is he here? Is he here? Is he there? Yes, everywhere. Then why I cannot see him? Prahlad Mahi told, Andha pita sujata nahi, hamme tumme khamba kharga me jahi khajata hi ram. Oh, father, you are spiritually blind. So you could not see Hari. He is inside you, inside me, inside your soul, inside this pillar. He is this pillar? Yes, father, he is inside this pillar. Then Hiranagasi became more angry. And he, with his fist, he crushed the pillar. When he crushed the pillar, that very tremendous sound came. And lion is roaring. And what happened? Nishinga Bhagavan came out from that pillar. Kambe Savayang Namigamna Mas and Manusam. He came half man and half beast, half animal. Why so? Because Brahmaji gave benediction to Hiranakasipu. That Hiranakasipu will not die by created by any living entity by Brahma. Not by day, not night, not in the sky, not in the land, not in the lower planet, not upper planet, not any weapon. So Brahma is devotee of Krishna, of Bhagavan. So, Satta Vidhatum Nijabhitta Bhasitam Kambe Savayam Namrigam Namanusam. Brahma has given benediction to Hiranyakasipu. So, Satta Vidhatum Nijabhitta Bhasitam. What Bhagavan's devotee has told, Bhagavan wants to keep his devotee's word. So, he came from pillar and not created by Brahma and not animal, and not man. So half animal, half man, half beast. And at that time was thus, neither day nor night. And what he did, just like a fisherman, they want to kill fish, and so when they hook the fish, they pull some time, lose some time, pull some time, lose some time. They play with that fish. In the same way, Hiranyakasipu want to Kill Bhagavan. Is it possible? He tried it by club, by sword, by his fist. Sometimes Bhagavan grabbed him, sometimes let him go. When Bhagavan grabbed him, all demigods became very happy. When Hirinaka Dev let him loose, then all demigods closed their eyes. Oh, what is going to be happen? But this way, Bhagavan took him on his thigh. Because Bhagavan, Brahmaji gave benediction. Not in the house, not in the outside of house, not inside house. So he took on his thigh and in the doorway. Not neither day nor night. What? In the time of dusk. In Gadhuli Samar. And not by any weapon, not any month, not any year. That is leap year. So he took and prepared his chest completely by his nail. So when Hirnakasipu killed him, when Hiranyakasipu was killed by Nishinga Bhagavan, then fire is coming for his main. It starts about to heavenly planet. All demigods, all are became so fearful. No one going to close to him to console him. Seeing this position, Brahmaji told to Brahma and Sivji, request Lakshmiji. Lakshmiji came and, oh, I never seen this furious condition of my Prabhuji. I can't go there. See, no, it is not possible for me. Brahmaji, not dare to go there. Then Brahmaji and others told, Oh, Prahla, for yourself, your Prabhu manifest here. Go to your Prabhu. Prahla Maharaj is no fear at all because he is near and dear, so he has no fear. Just like one lion kill an elephant, whole face full of blood, very ferocious. When he came back in his cave, his small calf jumped on his neck and biting, no problem. In the same way, he in killed Hiranyakasipu. He killed Hiranyakasipu and when he, Prahlad went to his lap, then he began to lick and told, Oh Prahlad, please excuse me, I became so late. 
ask any benediction, Prahlad told. I am not a businessman, then I shall ask any benediction. I serve you, then I shall take any boon. I don't like this, Bhagavan told. My darshan is infallible. You must have to ask any benediction. Then Prahlad Maharaj told, Oh my dear Lord, if you please on me, please liberate my father. He told, Oh Prahlad, Oh, if you want to give benediction, give me this benediction. No desire will be in my heart to ask any benediction from you. No, you have to ask something, must. Then he told, my father must be liberated. Then Bhagavan Nishimadev told, Oh Prahlad, your father liberated already. We were Uttam Bhakta like you. Is 21 generation will liberate it. If Bhattam, then 10, 14 generation. In Konishta, then 7 generation will liberate it automatically. Please ask another benediction. Prahlad Maharaj told, I want to take the sufferings all over the world and would suffer life after life and then liberate and do your bhajan. Then Nishim Bhagavan began to smile. Oh Prahlad, you are winner, I am loser. But it not be possible like this way. Whoever listen past times myself and dialogue between you and myself, they will be liberated from this world. So whoever want to be liberated from this world and they want to advance in Krishna consciousness, they must have to learn, have to listen all this Harikatha. So our previous Acharya, Jagad Guru Sila Bhakti Siddhartha Thakur Prabhupada, he gave class about Prahlad Maharaj more than 108 times. Why so? Guru Dev explained in his Dhyad Bhagavatam Mritam, it is coming very soon, it is under translation now. Hare Krishna. So Prahlad, Bhakta Prabhupada Prahlad Maharaj Ki Jai, Sarva Vigna Vinasan Karini Singh Dev Ki Jai, Gaur Premanande Hari Hari Bol. Pancha Kalpataru Bhastya Kiba Sindhu Bhai Vansha Kuliya Maharaj. Kirtan, Oh, <laughs> 